The fact that you oh. messaged my mom and you told her that you wanted to take her out on a date, is that the secret you wanted me to tell Whoa. you? Whoa! Whoa! Dude, your mom bad as hell, you can't blame You me. dated her mom! Why would you contact Holy. my mom? Holy! Because their daughter didn't want me, so I had oh. to level up. <laughs> my mom Look at like, RPG! Oh uh -huh. And now she's telling me that you want to f*** her. Whoa! I mean, that's what you do when you that's date. That's weird, Hayden. Don't you think that's, don't you think that's weird? I... Don't you think that's a little what? weird that you're hitting up my mom? Okay. Would you rather have a Charmander or a Charizard, huh? <laughs> I mean, I I was always on the side of the girl until he said that line, and honestly, you know that makes a lot of sense. The man's speaking facts. <laughs> he's, he's speaking mad facts out here. If the Charmander didn't want him and the full Charizard wants him instead, I I don't see what the problem is here. Why is she getting on the case? Anyway, what's cracking, guys? And welcome to some Pokemon memes. I know you were a little confused at first, but indeed, that was a Pokemon meme <laughs> right at the end. But I got some good stuff here waiting for you in the works out there. You guys know I'm a massive Pokemon fan out here. I mean, there's not a lot of clues that give it away. Regardless, though, you know, let's get straight into it. Hit that like, subscribe, support the channel with a comment, and let's get to it. Have you ever wondered what a Snom looks like from the underside? Well, now you know. It's got little nubs on it. It's got four little nubs. Like the bottom of a furniture that you can slide around. <laughs> it's just got the tiny little nubs. The more you know. Work by Park? Okay. <laughs> Why you cheese the Glaceon with no pup? I would never cheese any of my Eevees. Except for you, Potato. Have some cheese! An animation by Go. I kind of feel silly for admitting this, but I'm actually really nervous. This is my first We're time. We're gonna cry! <laughs> Betty, why? It's kind of strange that Arvin's the one with the female voice. <laughs> Yeah, Penny is the troll. I just, they were actually a really good crew of homies, man. It was a good gang to hang out with. It's a shame that we'll probably never ever see them again in a video game. But, you know, it's nice to move on from some of the old ones and get some new characters. You know, that's, it doesn't hurt me in the slightest. All right, so here we have uh, how to draw a totodile step. Step number one, literally just draw a totodile. Draw one part of totodile at a time, following the shapes. Just draw it. That's not really a good tutorial. It's just draw Totodile. You're not really helping like maybe some basic shapes so you can draw it in anything. It's, you just say just draw Totodile. It's not a very good tutorial book. Is that Pikachu taking a... Why is there a game with the Pikachu taking a dumpy on a toilet? I mean, at least it's a well-trained one. <laughs> Why would you want Pikachu on the dump? He's no longer a Pikachu. He's a peek a poo Oh, God! That's a Sarant with something here? Aww. Oh. <laughs> you just, why would you slap the poor Sprigatito with some cheese at Tito? <laughs> why is everyone just slapping everyone with cheese? It's not like I would slap poor little potato with some cheese! And just as you're asking, apparently there's another version. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Where Miaska Arata gets cheesed instead. Why well, is everyone cheesing the cat? It's clearly Fue Coco that has the cheese all over him. Why is he not getting slapped with more cheese? Screw you, unanthropize your low punny, and it's just a normal little rabbit. <laughs> well, dang, there you go, man. Now, now you got a normal looking rabbit out. I mean, it's got some cool features to it too. It's still cool looking. Dang, man. You, I think you just upset all the furries out there. How could you do that? Such a thing. How could you upset them? So here we have all yesterday with the artwork of Meowskarada being scared by the cucumber. <laughs> that is just right up in the air. Why are cats so scared of the cucumbers? They're actually like super effective. It's got to be because they're green and they look like snakes, right? That could be the only logical explanations. They just don't want to deal with the snakes and they see it and they think snake. So you hear that guys? Never whip out your cucumbers around the Ascarada. I know. I know that sounds a little bit weird to say, but I mean, don't take that anywhere else. 
This is actually really cool here. Danny with an artwork of Welcome to My Office with a bunch of Pokemon and Team Aqua Leader. <laughs> with all of them. That's so cool. I love how it actually is like an office, but it, the original is a guy in a tank right there. Just, you just skid it over with the Pokemon. It makes a lot of sense. It's a little dangerous for the four fish. If you put too much weight, you might crack the glass, but it, it is really cool. So comic by Ren here. Aw, oh, Nimona, you were such a cute kid. <laughs> wasn't I just? Oh, Pen, do you have any baby photos you can show us? I mean, I do, but I really don't want to. Show us, show us, show us. Uh, fine. And here, and it's, oh, she looks so plain. I like the Eevee plushie though, and. Uh, uh, uh. Wait, Penny, this is you? You look like a totally different person. <laughs> just them like. Uh. <laughs> you mean you didn't come out of the womb with your dyed hair? <laughs> to be fair, um, people typically can't recognize me as a kid because I just, I don't have facial hair. Uh, <laughs> so, you know, like, it is a bit weird. People look at me like, dang, what happened, man? You used to be so cute, Noble. Dad, where did I come from? Ditto, and I don't want to talk about it, son. <laughs> To be fair, it is a starter, and you never really get another chance to get a starter, so the only way you could get another one is by breeding it with the ditto. Pokemon really pushes the fact that you gotta use that ditto, man. You cannot get around using that ditto like a little breeding thing. Try to put that in the most respectful way I can. Ayano. Japanese a couple What the f do you say? <laughs> It's just like, what are we going on about? You are a different creature from me entirely, woman. <laughs> How would Iona even interact with such a plain, normal guy like Larry, who just probably doesn't care a thing about them VTubers, YouTubers, and other things like that? <laughs> How would he even do that? My alarm's every morning. Trying to get me to wake up 605, 625, 626. <laughs> Come on, get your Snorlax butt out of it. You ain't got no poker flute for my big ass. <laughs> you know, sometimes, you know, you just don't want to get up. And, you know, maybe all the time, it's one of those days. It's just one of those days where you... Okay, I'm, I'm done, I'm done. Detective Pikachu. Defective Pikachu. <laughs> just, one, just one little curve changes the entire thing so much. Although Defective Pikachu has its own little derpy charm, although the fact that its eyeballs and cheeks are reversed, a little bit concerning. So two type of po Pokemon artists you have, hey, look at my art, looks like accurate, versus, hey, come buy my art over <laughs> here. I'm a totally normal Pokemon artist. I draw normal Pokemon. <laughs> this is the most normal Pokemon. I don't know what you, you're concerned about over here, but we're, we're both Pokemon fans. You're the ones looking at my art. I mean, he's just got that face. That's the face of someone that you know you could trust with your secrets. Some shiny Pokemon are really funny in universe when you think about it. Oh, sure, you got a, a dead kid. But my dead kid has a special color. <laughs> my fan though. <laughs> okay, dude. Look at that. He's way cooler, more black, and has a red leaves. I made a bread multiple de <laughs> dead kids too. Try to get some more. How does that exactly work? How do the ghost Pokemon breed? Now we're opening up more pathways to conversations we really shouldn't be having. So Braxton and Lucario, and she seems to have some oh a little Valentine's chocolate. Here you go. Yes, I did it. As the Valentine's chocolate stuck to his little chest spike. <laughs> oh no. I mean, at least, you know, the, the message was across. The, the message was at least given to the recipient that, you know, needed to get it. Just a little bit sad about the state of the chocolate. Beats an entire generation of kids so hard to develop a mommy fetish. How did Game Freak get away with this with champion Cynthia? <laughs> I think out of all the characters in Pokemon, Cynthia's probably the one that all the fans flock to as the mommy one of all. I guess, you know, there's a reason. She's got the big blonde hair, looks cute, all black, kind of gothy-ish, very strong. I mean, I mean, come on. This Eevee Pog is cursed. I, I, I mean, what is its purpose? What exactly? would you use that thing for what 
Like, what exactly is that thing? What is that for? So, I have a picture of a flat little Vaporeon. Vaporeon could probably do this in canon. Like, several dex entries state that they're almost 100% water. True. When you tell his spoiled booty no, and he just deflates, okay? Come on, baby, time for your eardrops, and... Oh no, just blur. <laughs> blur me up. <laughs> Gosh dang it, man. Maybe you could just put it in there anyway, it'll absorb it, because it's mostly water. I don't know how it would work. Every time you want to get away, it would just melt through your fingers. That's kind of sad. I mean, it's a little bit cool, but like, I, I would feel bad if he you ever was taking a bath and you accidentally unplugged the drain and he started to go down. We... We have to break up. What? What? Why? It's not star you. It's star me. <laughs> just the final place at the end, dude. If he just took away the sheen and it was just blank. That would have been perfect. You talk to Pokemon, right? Do you think you could talk to God? I... I don't know, says Ed. <laughs> I mean, this actually makes a lot of sense, man. He wants to talk to Arceus and can canonically just talk to Pokemon somehow and knows their inner thoughts, which is crazy if you think about it. And I only know that because I recently just beat X. So, uh, so yeah, man, it's... I wonder how you know, God would actually say. What would he actually say? I'm the guy in the silver car in the background who's late for work because this gosh dang chicken is fighting a chandelier. <laughs> it's a Pokemon fighting game and I like how this nurse joined the bag with a Blissey and a Chansey. That's kind of cute. Yeah, that is kind of annoying just to see this Pokemon battle going on and you can't do anything because it's in the middle of the street. I mean, at least you get a good show. Anyway, that's gonna do it here for our Pokemon meme session. Hope you guys had some good chuckles, as always. Much love to all of you out there for enjoying the content. I have plenty of other videos. If you guys want to look out, check them out. But in the meantime, I at least hope to see you beautiful sons of guns again in the next video.